Hi, my name is Seti and in today's video we're looking at a brand new feature of Google Meet, assigning co-hosts ready for the new school year. Let's dive into it with another flipped classroom tutorial. Now this is a long awaited and requested feature for Google Meet. You're now able to assign co-hosts. Now what does that mean? That means your teacher assistant or another teacher can be assigned the same host privileges. So let's have a look at how it works. Here, I'm in a Google Meet. Now this is a Google meeting created by this account. Now I also have one participant in this meeting and this participant can be seen here. The participant is the teacher one account and I want to make this teacher a co-host. So you can see right here, this is the account of the teacher. And when he goes to his participants, he can see that I am the meeting host, but he can't change anything. When he clicks on those three dots, nothing there happens. He cannot remove that participant from the meeting because he is not a host. Now let's go to the original account. This is the original account, the account that created the meeting, and this account will assign co-host privileges. So in the bottom right corner, you'll find this little symbol that is all about your meeting security. So let's open up those security tools. These host controls enable us to now toggle an extra switch. Here at the top, we have the host management. As soon as we turn this on, we can now enable co-hosts. So let's close this and we're going to open up our participants window. We have two people here. Let's click on the three dots and you can see I can now grant host controls. So let's go ahead and click on this. This turns this teacher into a second meeting host. When I now go to that account, you will see it also highlights this account as a meeting host. I can click on the three dots of the other person and I can remove host controls from that other person. This way you can not only have multiple hosts of a single meeting, but you can also pass on the host settings from one to another. This is a long awaited update to Google Meet and it is the perfect time to roll this out. We're ready for the new school year. Many schools are going back and having co-hosts will enable you to have even more effective professional meetings with your students and also give those meeting controls to your teacher assistant or another fellow teacher. Now, I hope you found this helpful. If you did, make sure to scroll down. Let me know in that comment section below. Once you've done that, scroll back up, read that description, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you in the next one.